welcome back another month in a new perfume tray so as y'all can see this is my tray from the month of july my birthday month i enjoyed this tray um let me see what was my most used fragrance honestly live lux was probably my most used this month along with miami blossom because i was trying to use it up as y'all can see i have just a little bit left look y'all i was almost done with this i'm not done but um i think i'm going to repeat this for the month of august so yeah those two were definitely my most used i did get some more wear out of ariana grande's cloud i enjoyed this at nighttime i think the only one i honestly did not wear at all is this one and I, I don't even know if I wore this as well. So ugh, I'm a little mad because I wanted to wear this, but I didn't wear it. So now it's time to retire these fragrances off my tray. But yeah, these two were my most used fragrances. And this one was probably my favorite. So let's go ahead and get clean this tray off and add some new ones to focus on for the month of August. All right, so the tray has been emptied and it's clean. The first one I plan on wearing for the month of August is the Ode Juice Good Energy. And y'all, I've never worn this. If you guys watch my perfume haul, this was featured in my perfume haul. I will link the video in the cards. I received this as a birthday gift and I can't wait to test this out. Um, I can't remember what the notes are, but... It smells like something that I'm going to enjoy. So I can't wait to give y'all an update on that. Next, we have Sky De Joya by Giorgio Armani. This is like one of my easy grab fragrances. It's light. It's a fruity floral. Um, it's just easy. And that's why I'm adding this to the tray for when I don't really know what to wear. I can just pick this up and get some wear out of this. All right, also featured in my perfume haul is Skylar's Vanilla Sky. I've been wanting like some warm vanilla scents and this is like giving me those vibes. So I can't wait to wear this. I think this will be like my bedtime fragrance because it's still real hot. I mean, it's August. So I don't see myself wearing this like outdoors, but like when I'm in the house or at night, I think this will be perfect. Like I said, I'm going to add Miami's Blossom back. My goal is to have this finished by the end of this month, just so I can finally um, complete a perfume. Next, we're adding back uh, Gucci's Flora Gorgeous Gardenia. This is one of my favorite perfumes. As y'all can see by the dent on this, it's pretty, it's feminine, it's classy. Um, I just love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. It's light, but it lasts. Um, it sneaks up on you. And I just can't get enough of this scent. So I'm happy to wear this this month. All right. we Next, we have Trezor in Love by Lancome. Um, I'm not very familiar with this fragrance. I have Trezor Midnight Rose. That's like one of my favorite nighttime going out scents. So I decided to get in love and I don't love it as much as Midnight Rose, but this is nice. It's kind of green. It just reminds me of spring, being outdoors, walking around like lots of greenery and flowers. <laughs> so yeah, this is like, it's, it's just a pretty spring scent to me, spring, summer scent. So gonna wear, wear that. All right, next we have Valentino's Coral Fantasy. Um... I recently got this as well. Was this a Mother's Day gift? Yeah. And I haven't worn it since I got it. So I definitely want to get some wear out of this. This is fun. One of my favorite from Donna's Born in Roma collection. So yeah. Now we have a, a fragrance from Dossier. This is Am Ambry Saffron. This is supposed to be the dupe for uh, Baccarat, Fi Baccarat Rouge 540. And to me, this smells like cloud. <laughs> in a sense but it's a little bit different so i mean i like it i think i like it more as a fall scent but i wanted to see how i like it in the summer so i haven't worn it this year yet so i wanted to wear this next we have wonder rose by zara this is a nice pretty soft fragrance this is a toilet 
I like the Zara perfumes that I got, but I noticed that they don't last long, so it just makes me not want to wear them. I'm just not interested in them, but they are. This is a pretty fragrance. I think this was one of my favorites out of all the ones that I got in that haul. Next, we have a rose gold heart, and y'all look at my heart. It looks all beat up and dirty. I don't even want to show this. Let me, let me, yeah, this side. I think because I lay it on that side. But yeah, this is the rose gold heart. This one is just so pretty. Let me smell it again, y'all. I feel like this rose gold heart is the most unique out of all three of the, the gold hearts that she came out, the silver gold and rose gold. I think this is the most unique. It's pretty. Um, I like it a lot. It's just pretty and unique. Right next, we have Twirl. Yes, I think it's Twirl, right? This is Twirl. I'll leave uh, the exact name if I'm wrong, but I believe it's Twirl by Kate Spade. Yeah, it's Kate Spade's Twirl. I hauled this a long time ago, back when I was doing a bunch of perfume hauls. Um, I think I got this from like TJ Maxx. And I said that it smells kind of like oily and stuff, but I kind of do smell, it does still smell highly oily, I'm not going to lie, um, but it does have like watermelon and I smell a little bit of, of the watermelon and florals. It's a very light, those parts of the fragrance is very light, but I do get still like a lot of oil, but I just wear this when I'm wearing, Lord Jesus, <laughs> when I'm wearing stuff around the house, so. I'm going to add that to the tray. All right, and last but not least, for the month of August, I'm wearing a perfume that I got myself for my birthday. This is Coach Dream Sunset. Y'all, I cannot wait to wear this fragrance. I have wanted this fragrance for such a while. And look at how pretty. It's just so pretty. I just love it. Look at it. Anyways, this has like pear ice cream and some other notes so i'm very interested in seeing how this wears and i want to give y'all an update so hopefully at the end of the month i will be able to update y'all on this fragrance and all the other ones that's new that i added to my tray for the month of august so yeah just take a look a nice array of fragrances let me know what y'all think and comment down below what you think will be my most worn fragrance for the month of august out of all the ones that i picked out what do you think will be my most worn or most loved comment down below all right so that's it for my monthly tray perfume tray rotation thumbs up if you enjoyed this video if you're not already subscribed to my channel make sure you hit the subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you're notified every time i upload a video i love you guys and i'll see y'all in my next one bye